What the hell was that? Okay. An anvil. It's very awkward. No way he ever walks any quicker. I get back. Yeah, it's the booger. What the hell was that? Okay. An anvil. All right, well, it's probably like a TV or something. I don't know what it was. Why did I jump back over here? Where are you going? Come back here. Six twenty six thirty. Shit, time to go. But how, how, how am I going to get back? I knew they going to do that. Knew it. Six twenty six thirty. Been so awkward. It's been shit. Yeah. This must have been his locker. Okay, I want to do the the combination and get pissed off, but I won't do it. Oh, excuse me. I found two more tapes. One of them is dated October 10th. That's the day after the first one we watched. Put it in. Well, I'll put it in, all right. Have you made a decision? I thought you said I didn't have a choice. Well, technically you do. You can terminate the pregnancy or leave Crawford. Of course, that would be a death sentence for both you and your unborn child. Maybe that's best. I stayed up all last night thinking about this. Why are we even trying to survive, to keep on living, if this is what it takes, if this is what it's turned us into? I don't make the rules, Anna. Doctor, I'm begging you, please help me. Maybe one day, when things are different, you can try again. But for now, today, we have to do this. No. No. Seven five one three or something. I think we know what happened to Crawford. More importantly, we got the combination. <laughs> you from Crawford? You know that woman? Krista, are you all right? What's wrong? It's nothing. That was just hard to watch. Don't worry about me. I'm fine. All right. Let's get those meds and get the hell out of here. Zero, what? We're in business. Zero eight six five. Antibiotics. Oh, was on, I don't know. Morphine. We take as much of this as we can carry. What about the other tape? Okay, I think we're good. I want that camcorder. More than enough for your people and mine. Let's go. Time to we record some. Third tape in the locker outside. Maybe there's something else on there. We got the meds for Omid. That's all I care about. We'll head back to the classroom. Don't take too long, Lee. I could just walk with it.
slog in en simmanning och en sån. Listen, as fun as this was, I have to put a stop to this little arrangement. This is the last I can give you. Why? Oberson had someone down here yesterday taking inventory. He's Yo, she was sucking? Down. I just can't risk it. Or something? We had a deal. It was not strange for a little change. We don't anymore. My sister needs this medicine. Without it, she'll die or she'll start showing symptoms and they'll take her away. I can't let that happen. That's what you were mad about? Sorry, Molly. I've done all I can, but I have to look out for myself here. Yeah, that's the Crawford way, isn't it? Why do you keep turning it back to women, dog? Are you trying to get stabbed twice? You know, I think it's the first time he died. Well, shit. Very telling. Uh, her sister's probably still alive then. Or where she got it all to. I don't know what she went with a battery. Jesus Christ! What's up? Oh, you scared the shit out of me. Where the fuck have you been? Sightseeing. I'll take Check out the battery. battery now. Oh, yeah. Uh, about that. I'm just kidding. Here you go. Oh, I feel like she switched it. What's that? Nothing. I can see it. You lied to me. What? You said you'd never been here before, but that wasn't the truth, was it? What? Who told you that? I saw you on a security. You did. Team. You were having an affair with that doctor. I didn't lie. I asked you how you knew about Crawford. You said you just heard stories. I said there were stories about Crawford. I never said that's how I knew about it. I never lied to you, and even if I did, so what? I don't owe you anything. You saved my life twice, but you can't tell me the truth? Are we really gonna do this now? I guess that's up to you. Didn't you lie to Krista? I used to live here. Whatever that chick's name is. She was 14 years old. When the dead started walking and Crawford shut itself in, it seemed like a pretty good deal at first. We were safe. We had everything we needed to survive. Then the rules started coming down. No one who couldn't justify their place and their keep. Yeah, I'm trying to see no what that mouth do. I don't care what you're talking about right now. My sister was diabetic, and by Crawford's rules, that made her a liability. I kept it a secret. I kept her safe for as long as I could. But in the end, I couldn't protect her. That's when I got out. Crawford... They always talked about how their system worked, how anything was better than becoming one of them. But I saw what they'd already become. I just wish I could have seen it before it was too late, before they came and took my sister away. This is all I have left of her. She was old as hell. I didn't have time to take it before I got out of Crawford. I just wanted it, okay? It's okay, Molly. I understand. But it's pretty. What the hell? What the hell would I, I say that? You to get the hell out of here. Don't give a damn. She look old as hell. I think it's gonna be open. What do we have? Jesus! Shit. Mm. Sorry, sorry. I just got spooked by those bells, and then I heard someone coming. We're okay. Did you get that door open in the classroom? Not yet. Kenny sent me out to look for something. I should have stared. To bust it open. I found this. That was on the door. Vin, where did you? How about you just look behind you? Found it. It was stuck in the door handle at the end of the hallway back there. Oh no. That doesn't make any sense. If he took it off a while ago, they would have been busted in. It goes Ninja Molly. Oh, Come on. Shoot this fucker. All right, stop moving. Nice shot. Thank me later. Wait, can I shoot her? I need to look that up too. Ben, we gotta go. Ben, what are you Move doing? 